In this video, we demonstrate the collaboration of an aerial and a ground robot in a mock-up search and rescue scenario. We launch a quadrotor to search for a victim that must be provided with a first aid kit by a ground robot. The quadrotor scans the area to find the victim and detect obstacles for the ground robot. It navigates autonomously using only its onboard computer and onboard sensors, a downlooking camera and an inertial measurement unit. No remote control, GPS or motion capture system is required. As soon as the quadrotor has covered the entire area, it computes the fastest mission for the ground robot to reach the victim. The ground robot can remove obstacles to reach the victim faster. Our mission planning algorithm computes the fastest mission, taking into account the time for both driving and removing obstacles. The quadrotor then commands the ground robot step by step on its mission. After each step, it localizes the ground robot to correct for drift in the velodometry. Once close to an obstacle that has to be removed, the ground robot uses its laser scanner to precisely determine the relative obstacle position and grasp it safely. Since the ground robot is in a narrow corridor, it cannot place the obstacle to its side. Therefore, it has to be placed in front of the corridor. Then, the ground robot can proceed to grasp the second obstacle, which can be placed after the corridor to avoid additional driving. Now the path to the victim is clear and the ground robot can deliver the first aid kit.